Okay, FM one zero one point seven seven. Tafumra Sebe Jenny, a Echo Vincent Asifua. Was I see a Emra Nimini, sign a deputy minister, local government and rural development. Honorable MP, watch here. Hello. Joshua Bupacha me no pe ena na efo ade oyeye no so wa ye mra nimni di e we di e no mo nko komo kakre na eh wo modi rule ni abedi etumi kan wan sem na ye bibia na wo hwe ni mu se eno ana nka be si well my main chair was here for uh no main chair bibi kakre been through the judgment from supreme court on and yet necessarily 5 2 the supreme court is say all actions, with the exception of jurisdiction, to say actions are not a relief, sir. A final marking at the court court, you know, Nina are succeeding on the basis of a unanimous decision. Name you know, with the issue of jurisdiction, whether or not the Supreme Court a war a queen. So betina asemno so, and now say only a kwenye so betina asemno so, and no na na ye five two. The part what matter? The part what matter? The part what matter? Ah, on a part what matter? Pa. Aha. So mm. aye uh, only on the issue of jurisdiction, but mm. all other relief okay, okay. was unanimous. That is, all the judges agreed. Okay. That is number one. Mm. Number two, the effect of this judgment, and they say the majority side remains the majority. So say dom dodo no our parliament no. Omo daso aye dom dodo. Ana dom kuma no so edaso aye dom kuma. Number two. Number three, the effect again is that all the MPs are, you can say, 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 MPs, you know, based on the ruling that came from the Speaker of Parliament, you know, and also so, any Juma. Supreme Court is saying, the effect of the judgment of the Amano. So, the effect again is that the Speaker of Parliament cannot sit in Parliament to reconstitute the dynamics of what Parliament says. Speaker will be a dumb woman as a dumb dodoa. And no, no, yes, Speaker, it doesn't lie in his mouth to show that or no, never say women are a dumb woman, women are a dumb dodoa. That one can only be seen. A year at the polling stations. One year to at the ballot. That is when you can decide whether someone is an MP or not. The effect, that is number five, the effect again of the Supreme Court judgment, you know, so what they say. See, you be say, oh, yeah, MP, it is within the contemplation of a year or more, more to abano. And nobody, and again, nobody can cut short the lifespan of a member of parliament that has been given under the constitution of the Republic of Ghana. And the Yakotua Banoa, the Isaac, seven December, Kotua Bama, and the Marshall Bijania, or Batua Bama, and the Marshall Bijani. 
na na dream no otoma ne wi a otoma ne se o maye dwuma mfie nan obi antimi nkata san fie nan ne short mm unless of course that four years na e dey aso and san na e beto no so aba ya to no so aba number 6 the effect again of the judgment of the supreme court and they say as a member of parliament on the ticket of the new patriotic party mm-hmm. it is a mere margin say nine parliament near the call of january no so nine parliament no many mp before to quanta apaya and you know the best of the court joining the nine parliament in the view the moment you are joining nine parliament now this will be two and a more and a montuno semitono, it has been enshrined in the constitutional instrument that is CI Noa, Electoral Commission, the Bayern, in the San Montuno, also Michel C. Free Baby, and San Mababa joining the ninth parliament. It cannot be the case, you say, if I declare an intention to join the next parliament on the ticket of a different political party or to go independent, Meko Contemco. Which is different from my current political party, it does not mean or amount to the fact that I have jettisoned my political party. You know, and until you mean to me, contest and enter the next parliament on a different political party, that will mean that you are trampling on my fundamental human rights because my fundamental human rights, and say, so if you do and watch it, when if you do watch here, make to me. Ako Parliament. Uh, and that's my name for uh, uh, the new back uh, 21. Meet me Ako Parliament. No ko Parliament, I can come out and I'm meet my representative in Kofo. And he said, Well, my mind, kwa, not as a who deny me. And so that is what the Supreme Court's judgment and its ruling. Eka. And so clearly, you could see, say, all the actions that a federal marking at the court court you know, all the actions has succeeded on the issue of jurisdiction court to say they five to we are yet to see the reason justice Ahmad Dutanko and um justice lovelace i'm going to dissent here as to whether say interpretation matters in local supreme court or not you know, i'm yet to listen and hear or read what the two judges echo about the issue of jurisdiction as far as the interpretation of the constitution are concerned. But I have very tried, tried knowledge from all cases that are bound from the four versus attorney general, the J.H. and I mean, all the cases that we've, we've read that the interpretation of the constitution of the Republic of Ghana is the sole prerogative of the Supreme Court of Ghana. It deals with the effect of okay, the Supreme Court ruling. You know, HSA. Seven, seven. There were three arms of government. And the three arms of government, you know, will be our government, be our government 101, but shall say, there were executive, legislature, and there were judiciary. Now, all these three arms of government, you know, they are under the constitution of the Republic of Ghana. Ghana, we practice a constitutional supremacy, not the supremacy of an arm of government. For example, that is how come when the president sacked a year the Auditor General, the Supreme Court told the president of the Republic of Ghana by way of a judgment that that was a wrong move and it did not have the power to sack the Auditor General because the terms and engagement of the Auditor General could not have allowed the President to do so. That means that the Executive, even President Dekufuado, is under the Constitution of the Republic of Ghana because we practice constitutional supremacy, mm. not executive supremacy, nor legislative supremacy, nor judiciary, um, judicial um, supremacy. Adebako and the Manijie who and that's 5 2 nearby. 5 2, do you know what that means? It means that the Supreme Court is a thinking platform 
the Supreme Court is a thinking avenue. The Supreme Court is a thinking room. These are thinking people into Bia or Najene and interpret the law or the constitution based on anonymity as here. And that means that this argument of unanimous FC in the they are bogus, frivolous, vexatious, they are things that you just cannot give any meaningful you to it. And so I am glad that today democracy has won. Rule of law has won. Democracy is hinged on the tenets of rule of law. Oshe Ghana now compare with all the West African countries and I say even Africa by extension. Ghana is a star of peace as far as our democratic credentials are concerned. We have shown to be matured. We have proven that maturity, maturity pedestal that when it comes to democracy, Ghana is a beacon of democracy. And today, we have reaffirmed that indeed, Ghana is a star of democracy. And that is what has happened today. So it is democracy that won today, not the executive, not the legislature, not the judiciary or not a final market. Democracy has won today. Mm. Uh, uh, well, as far as standing on the senior concern in the state, see a call a parliamentar. Yeah, yeah, and speaker of parliament in Arno. A bayer now can say, Oh, now I dear, and as I said, the idea on one who say in the public interest, also a fair parliament in the public interest, also a fair parliament, and I say. There should be a petition, a petition to the Speaker of Parliament indicating to him, say, so, so, and so, so, and so, these urgent reasons in Tino, 15% of us are about to get that we have signed a petition. Please call Parliament urgently within seven days. Within seven days. Emphasis mine. Within seven days. The Supreme Court, I'm uh, sorry, Speaker of Parliament, within seven days, will give a notice and also give members of Parliament maximum seven days' notice. So that is what I think will happen in the next few um, hours or days so that we can recall Parliament to consider a year agent business. I'll say a year. Now, we are going to say, the Crawford will be surprised, Kakra will say, oh, Speaker, pass, that day. Uh, with the acquittal of Mrasibe Jofia Jumediem as an NP, now I rise to the position of Speaker. Now we him standing orders in name of Mrana Monsisi Yeyina. Now, what you say now we hear uh, Supreme Court, Edi Abase, and Namu Mra Kwanso no. Me ni muada, but and ye bibi kakra. Question I mentioned and tell you. Uh -huh. Any. Yeah, yeah, honorable Bagbina. Why, yeah, MP. Any, I'm not saying you fear. Mumra, no one says, yeah, and it said, yeah, we're going to be in a. And now, no more, yeah, we're going to be a copy of Supreme Court, no. What you know, I'm not saying you fear. I want to be a copy of Supreme Court, no. What you know, I'm not saying you fear. I want to be a copy of and think I could be full for a crowd wouldn't need Monsisa, yeah, Moody, a German, because you be all naive and now you're alien to Monsisa. But what could you be away and prepare for several years, nay, experience or way? No better one, I'm more busy, maybe I could be Supreme Court of my interpretation, now, but say, and you're unlawful, no, and you're a Well, what the argument from the um, plaintiff? Any attorney general, no, at the NSA. Who is the Speaker of Parliament? It's now Professor Michael Quay. Now, I said, no, okay, and I saw in 2020. Mm -hmm. Now, 2020, around I think, September, October, there about. Okay, I okay. know the Bua said yeah, there's already a president yeah, here yeah. on the floor of Parliament. But you see, there's an argument to be our seeing now, you know, the three arguments now. So, Isaac was to the way. Sir Isaac, a boy, 
na for the dixon and country ochina osa ba no asa bo wasu wan kashe o so so a wan fa nko ko te o uko uko report to the police say si uno for um assault and i say okay so o yan a civil matter ti en si uno on the basis and obviously we'll see on the basis of battery if that is not done it does not make it right if somebody does it again tomorrow mm. so the next day no so you have to man so the real studio no no so it doesn't make it right so the fact that as the ball was soon but i come you know i am can wash and i say i'm going supreme court and i am going to wash it doesn't mean that the no visa ball was and i say you know cray and i say right so the attorney general made this argument vociferously that you can even repeat an unconstitutional act 30 times it doesn't make it right what is right today is that see you will be as a member of parliament for four years that is right it does not lie in the mouth of a speaker to cut that term short in the speaker of parliament then so so among yourself he has to serve his pay masters he has to serve his political party and for that matter we'll do the bedding of the political party remember it was harun and drisu and the kujina simply so our tamale and we can mass signals they say the 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 ndc is now majority in the house of parliament the NDC is now the, uh, the majority in the House of Parliament. And no Nema for the market equity for an interpretation of what Article 97 is. So that the Speaker of Parliament will have his hands tied not to even attempt to declare the matter. But we realized that he was bent on doing so. So we went to court to secure for an ex parte application. Which ex parte application was supposed to tie his hands to stay the execution of the so-called pronouncement. But in any now, but every year, Supreme Court at said, four years, no, uh, four years, will be to be cutting short. An intention of the person, no, to join the next parliament on the ticket of a different political party, and I say independent, no. Does not lie in the mouth of anybody to say that okay, because of that, I have chosen my party for the current parliament. Simplicity. Mm, I see. Oh no, you better say no pay. Now, where do you work when you be say now campaign? So to say. Oh, nyamiyado. Mm. Campaign ya boko. Oh, ta for the suwe nitia. Mhm. Ah, what do you see? Ah, you see pa. Mhm. Inti. Ah. I'm a phone so much, I'm a more fast, you know, money and I'm a mini problem. I deal with you, I'm a shaman. 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 I'm a and people will be free by power from the war war. So the message has been that you should vote. You should vote and vote very well for Dr. Muhammad Ibaomiya. Honorable Adasiano Pei. Let me show you, Pei. Honorable Echo Vincent, as if we are a former Sibir Jani, was I a deputy minister? Local government and rural development. Okay, FM. Okay. One zero one point seven seven.